Hey guys, Jonathan here from TechMajesty.com. Today I'll be showing you how to unlock your Sprint iPhone X. The phone was just released today and I'll be showing you how to unlock it step by step through this easy process. Now I'm going to show you this on the iPhone X, but this method will work on all other Sprint iPhone models as well. This method will also work to unlock Boost Mobile and Virgin Mobile iPhones too. Our Sprint iPhone unlock will unlock any Sprint iPhone regardless of any outstanding balances, contracts, financing, blacklist status, etc. What makes our Sprint iPhone Unlock unique is the ability for the phone to be used both domestically in the US and internationally with any GSM carrier. What that means is that once we unlock your Sprint iPhone, you can use it with any GSM carrier in the US. For example, AT&T, T-Mobile, Metro PCS, Simple Mobile, Cricket, Straight Talk, etc can all be used on your Sprint iPhone once we unlock it. Besides being able to use the phone in the US, you can also use it with any GSM carrier of your choice internationally as well. The unlock will not affect your warranty, it will increase the resale value of your phone and you'll be able to use the phone with any GSM carrier of your choice. To unlock the phone, you will need your computer, it can be a Mac or PC, the latest version of iTunes, a non-allowed SIM card, which is basically a SIM that's not from your original carrier, and a USB cable. If you do not have a non-allowed SIM card, later on in the video I'll show you how to unlock the phone using no SIM card at all. Now that we have all that ready, let's begin. The first thing we will need is the 15 digit IMEI number of the phone, which you can get by going to the dialer of the phone and dialing star pound zero six pound. This will give you the 15 digit IMEI. So, now that we have the IMEI number of the iPhone, we will go on the computer and open the internet browser to go to techmajesty.com. Once we are on this website, we will place an order to unlock our iPhone. We will choose the iPhone X since that's the phone we're unlocking today. Then, for the carrier option, you will choose the carrier your iPhone is locked to, such as AT&T, T-Mobile, Sprint, Metro PCS, Boost Mobile, Virgin Mobile, Verizon, etc. My phone is locked to Sprint, so that's the carrier I'll be choosing. After that, you will enter the 15-digit IMEI number that we got in the beginning of the video. Then, you will click on the Add to Cart button and go through the checkout process to complete your order. Once you complete the checkout, you will receive an email within the stated time frame informing you that your iPhone has been unlocked. The email will look like this and will let you know that your iPhone has been successfully factory unlocked and it will include full instructions on how to complete the unlock. We will be using the first method and unlocking the phone using iTunes and a non-allowed SIM card. Now if you do not have a non-allowed SIM or any SIM card for that matter then you can simply restore the iPhone as a new phone through iTunes to complete the unlock. Make sure you do not restore the phone just from the backup because in order for the unlock process to be completed, the phone must be restored as a new iPhone. You can then later restore from backup or from the iCloud to get your data back. So go ahead and grab your iPhone and insert the non-allowed SIM card into the phone. My phone is locked to Sprint, but I would like to use AT&T on it, so I'm inserting my AT&T SIM card into the phone. Once the SIM card has been inserted into the phone, grab one end of the USB cable and connect it to the computer and the other end to the iPhone. Now that we have the iPhone connected to the computer, open up iTunes and wait for iTunes to detect the iPhone. Once iTunes detects the iPhone, you'll get the following message saying congratulations, your iPhone has been unlocked. So that's it, the phone is now permanently factory unlocked and you can restore, upgrade or do anything else to the phone and the phone will remain unlocked. As you can see, we are receiving signal and LTE is listed at the top right hand corner of the screen. If you go into settings, AT&T is also listed as the network. So that means the unlock worked perfectly. So guys, it's as simple as that to unlock your iPhone and to start using it with any GSM carrier of your choice in the US or internationally. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below and don't forget to subscribe if the video helped you. Thank you so much for watching.